All right, folks. Um, we got the tires off. We're getting ready to do the brake bleeding. We are inspecting the rotors here. The rotors got some damage done to them. And uh, the pads still look fairly decent. He just put them on, but he said that he's going to wait in the rotors. We're going to check this side over here. And uh, this is the side that he said the uh, piston came out on. These rotors, same as the other side, dimple in the middle here, edge, edge, some burnt marks. So uh, he's got the, he said he's got the weight in the rotors. Oh, wait, there's an issue. That pad is on backwards. You see there, folks? So we're going to take this caliper off, fix that pad. This pad's on the right. But, yep, that's backwards. So we're going to fix that. Make sure the uh, piston's okay on that one. <clears throat> and the service mode here, folks, it's electronic e-brake, emergency uh, e-brake, wherever you want, parking brake. So you got to put it in service mode to actually work on these. So before I even loosen this up or anything, I'm going to put this in service mode for the brakes. And that way it stops putting power here. That way it does not push the cylinder back out. All right, folks. We're getting our dongle. We use a top scan. We'll put the truck. down folks and got the tablet we're closing us here okay we're loading top scan Diagnosis, forward, connect, automatic. We're gonna do some reading. Confirm. Hit the state emissions. All right, got the info there. We're gonna hit service, chassis, braking. Maintenance mode. Okay. Blah, blah, vehicle must be in park. Blah, blah, yes. Operating process. We are checking things out. Complete the necessary work. Click OK, continue. Okay, so now we have it on hold. So we're going to go around. I don't think you really need to see me do the brake systems in this. I'm sure you've seen it done a hundred million times with vehicles. And our first step is over here. So we got the vehicle in service mode. Gonna find a little electricity here, a little magnet, a little metal. So we can go ahead and uh, put our 
Lightner. And see, it, it's turning. So we'll get a fix for that real quick. See if I get you guys in another spot. All right. Grab a little shot towel here. Loosen now. Destroy my life. Drop a crap. Wants it spin. I think right now I'm not liking the way this is now. Check our threads. Threads look okay. Check this one out. Threads look okay. I'm gonna take the tool, get in here a little bit. A lot of times I just use a flat screwdriver. We're good now. This is a reversing caliper. Hang it up. Where the pad was. And the thing I like to do is take a little lube, put on my ears. That stops the movement. Put it in bracket. Hold in bracket. Always fight with these a little bit. I do mean always. Here we go. That's on. We're gonna take this one back off. We're gonna put some lube on it. It stops it any squeaking. Just put a little bit on it. Get it in place. Drop it as always. And they're in place. We're going to give it a good cleaning. I 
that's that. Let's check out this caliper here. See what we can do with this rubber here. Put it back the way it belongs. Okay, I like to get a little bit of this, put it on the back of this cal uh, pad over here. We're just putting a little bit on it, stop the noise there. Okay, let's just take these out, pop the rubber off. Wipe it off. They're not rusty, so we don't need to take a wire brush to them. Put a little bit on the tip. Push it back on. Push it all in place. Pop it off. Always clean these pins. These pins will save you money in the long run. I thought I just heard the door open. Okay, pins are done. This is actually the Harbor Freight kit. Let's put our light back to our balloons. Like this one. Put it on over the handle. Boom. All right, we're gonna chase this caliper screwed up now. Too. Yep, this cover's got to be replaced. Sure does. Hey, right, I'll call the customer. Hey. Yeah. Let's go. Pick your up. Drop my nuts out. What the fuck? All right, so we're gonna go ahead and just take this caliper here. That way we can go ahead and replace it. Um, this one's no good. So let's get to work on that. Connection there. Uh, 
that connection's out. We're just going to set this in place like this. And when we get the things here. Socket in here, small. I'm sure we do. Let the socket get in here. This next question. Looks like it's gonna be a ten. Or a bit. Let's go get one. Hey, we got a bunch of crap in this hole here. We're going to try to get it out. We're going to get the bit in there. We're just using a pick. Watch your eyes. See what that does. See if this is any room. Now, I will tell you, I've never done one of these on this before. So we are doing first time together. I tell you, it is all rusted. Uh, it is really rusted. All right, I'm going to disconnect that. Um, power source here, and I'm going to disconnect the caliper completely, and I'm going to do it on the vice because there's just not a lot of room back there. And uh, I can tell you, there's all kinds of crap there. Oh my god, nothing this wants to move. There is so much debris of this thing. We're going to stick a couple bolts back in it just to hold it. Just to hold it in place. See if I can get you guys in a better angle here. Oof. 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 Crap falling out of there. Alright, we're gonna take this line off.
our plug kit here. So we are going to float this line. That we don't leak all of our fluid out. I don't mind leaking out some of that crap fluid in there though. This one works. Yeah, that one worked. Alright. Now we're going to go ahead and take this off and put it in the vise, see what's going on with it. Place this bolt because we don't want to go through that again. folks well this truck is going to be on hold until monday we've got a special order the part because uh, it has the uh, electronic parking brake so that's where we're at with this um okay as for the giveaway the giveaway um thank you first everybody for uh us reaching the 500 subscribers it is the doratech ratchet set um, you already see many videos on it. And the rules, you have to be in the United States. You have to be subscribed to the channel. You have to comment on this video. And, uh, that's basically about it. So, um, we will let this video go up. And end of next week, we will do some name drawing. And we will go from there. So, later, folks. Enjoy and thank you.